Hello guys, my name is Ankit Darjan. Welcome back to your favorite channel into color house. Today I'll show you the secret of cinematic saturation. Shh. So let's open a DaVinci Resolve. This is the good start viewpoint. Now I'm gonna show you how to do air saturation, not digitally, but it's look like film saturation. So this footage from Blackmagic Design and before jump to saturation process, we have to add one node and adjust of exposure and white balance. For white balance, take this picker tool and choose only white area, nothing else. Simply just press on white area and your white balance is done. Now adjust exposure with the help of lift, gamma and gain. And once your exposure and white balance done, your node will be done. You can add two nodes and also you can label it like saturation 1 and saturation 2. Now, First of all, we choose saturation 2 instead of saturation 1. You can push saturation up to 100 in saturation 2 node. In this case, I almost add 100 saturation. Now, grab still of saturation 2 node and then after you can disable this node via press command D on your Mac keyboard. You have to move your saturation 1 node and press right button on your mouse and choose HSV from your color space. Now, one more time press right click on your mouse and add go to channel. But there is a three channel which shows you mark individually. It's mean channel one is equal to hue, channel two is equal to saturation and channel T shows you value. So we have to only adjust saturation. It's mean channel one and channel three should be unmarked. Then push your gain to 1.6 to 1.7. In this case, I'm gonna choose 1.6 amount. Bada bing, bada boom. And it's done. You can clearly see difference between both the process. In traditional saturation process, adding more brightness and luminous. But in second process, looks very natural and cinematic look. If you want to know more about this kind of secret, comment down below. Till then, like, share and subscribe.